Good morning, my beautiful people. Today we're going to go through ODK and how to connect it with Kibana. Now, ODK is similar to Kobo Toolbox. It's just another website that serves to create surveys. But in this case, we, we access the surveys through our phone. So there are certain prerequisites that we need to do in order for us to connect ODK with Kibana. So in this case, we need three components. We need ODK Central. Uh, this is a website. It looks like this. The homepage looks something like this. And you create a form. And in this case, we have two predefined forms. Uh, we also need an app. It's called ODK Collect. You can download it from your Play Store. And the main menu looks something like this. Uh, so those are the three. We need ODK Central, we need an empty survey that we already created in ODK Central, and we need to download ODK Collect. Uh, the, 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 the motive why we have ODK Collect is to collect the information that goes into the forms, but we also need to connect ODK Collect to ODK Central account. And I'm gonna show you right now how to do it. So you go to ODK Central, you click on your form that you wanna export, and you go to App Users, and you create a new user, uh, you type on the nickname that you desire, and when you create, connect, uh, when you click create, uh, there is a barcode that will pop up and you keep it there in the meantime then you go into your phone uh, you open ODK collect uh, you click on those little three points and it should uh, give you an option of admin settings where you have to click on import and export settings that will bring you to this image and you click on scan code from other devices and you hover your phone over the barcode in ODK Central. Once the, once the device already recognized the account, then you go back to the main menu where you click on get blank form, you select test. In our case, we're gonna select test and then we click fill blank form. And that's how you set up the ODK Collect with the ODK Central. So once you're done with that, you fill in the form, obviously, and you fill it with multiple users. So let's go back to our test. Um, and in here, you can see I have four submissions. So I'll click on testing again, and we go to submissions, and it shows you the four users that we have here. Now we want to connect Kivana with ODK Collect, uh, with ODK Central, sorry. So we click on download all records and it will give you an option of choosing CSV file. So you pick it up and it will download it as an Excel comma separated file. Uh, you store it in your computer and then you go back to Kibana. And you do the same kind of logic behind the Kobo toolbox. So I have it right here. And in here is kind of different. You will see that the some of the last fields are different. I'm going to show you the fields in here. So you see before we had index, et cetera, et cetera. Now we have key, submitter ID, submitter name. And if we go above, you can see that we no longer have the questions like Kobo Toolbox did link the questions. So this is the only disadvantage that we have so far is the fact that we have to go through our data. We have to go through our forms and we have to link it. So for example, if I go to G1A1, we see that that's definitely the gender of the user. So we click gender, we type gender and so forth. We have to do that with every single uh, unit in here. 
uh, I'm gonna import and we just give it a name and import it I already did that beforehand so I'm just gonna go and show you how the information looks like at the end oh sorry wrong button and this is the four feet the four users that submitted with the questions and the answer